Hey guys, today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I make my seafood boil. So these are all the ingredients that I'll be using today. I have here two lobster tails, some crab legs, and some black tiger shrimp. For the seasonings, I'll be using all-purpose seasoning, Cajun seasoning, onion powder, garlic powder, some cayenne pepper, some minced garlic, salt, black pepper, lemon pepper seasoning, and of course we have Old Bay seasoning. Now next we have some unsalted butter. We have one lemon, one onion, some parsley flakes, and about five to six small potatoes. And as always, I'll have all the measurements listed in the description box below. Now before we begin, I want to say hello to everybody tuning in. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you for your continued support. And if you are new here, welcome and thanks for stopping by. And if you like today's video, please make sure to give it a like, subscribe to my channel for more recipes, and leave a comment letting me know how you make your seafood boil. Now let's begin. I'll start by cutting up my potatoes into small pieces, that way they cook evenly. Next, I'll be cutting up my sweet corn. I usually break them up into about three pieces per ear. Now I'll slice my onion. You could also just rough chop the onion into about four pieces. It's totally up to you. And now I'm gonna cut a few slices of lemon. I'll only be using about half the lemon in the pot. And then the other half of the lemon I'll be using in the butter later. Now for the seasoning, I'll be starting with a quarter cup or four tablespoons of Old Bay seasoning, two tablespoons of paprika, one tablespoon of onion powder, one tablespoon of Cajun seasoning, one tablespoon of black pepper, half a tablespoon of lemon pepper seasoning, half a tablespoon of garlic powder, half a tablespoon of all-purpose seasoning, half a tablespoon of cayenne pepper, and one tablespoon of salt. Now I'll just give this a good mix. And then I'll remove about two tablespoons and place in a separate dish, as this is what I'll be using in my butter later. Now in a large pot of boiling water, I believe this is about five quarts, I'll be placing my onion, lemon slices, minced garlic, and my blended seasonings. Now I'll add in my potatoes and my corn. And I'll be adding some parsley. And I'm just gonna let this boil for about 10 to 15 minutes, just until my potatoes begin to get tender. Now that the potatoes are almost done cooking, I'll be adding in my lobster tail. And I will cook this for about five minutes, as lobster tails usually take about seven to nine minutes to boil. After the five minute mark, I'll be adding in my crab legs and my shrimp. Now I'll be adding my crab legs and the shrimp in at the same time because my crab legs are already pre-cooked. So I technically just need to warm them up again. If you are using fresh crab legs, I would add them in separately and boil them for about two to three minutes before adding in my shrimp. Now I'll only boil this for two minutes as the shrimp only takes about two minutes to cook. All right, so the seafood is completely cooked. So I'll just be removing everything from the pot and I'll place it into a dish. And then now I'll be making my butter. 
Now on medium to low heat, I'll be melting one pound of butter. Once the butter is all nice and melted, I'll be adding in about four to five tablespoons of minced garlic. Give everything a good mix. And then I'll be adding in the two tablespoons of blended seasoning that I had put away earlier. Next, I will squeeze in half a lemon right into the butter. And then add in about one and a half tablespoons of parsley flakes. Give everything a good mix and then remove the butter from the pan. Now I'm just gonna pour all that delicious butter all over this gorgeous plate of seafood. And there you have it, my seafood boil. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time on Mama's Easy Kitchen.